So SCM is basically a, um, is an attempt to use engrams in combination with a Markov um, with variable um, like Markov chains in order to perform grammar checking. Uh, as far as I know, this hasn't been done. Though engrams are used in text generation, <coughs> which replicate a certain style. Uh, in general, engrams are a uh, Sir, um, are a list of are a list of words that appear in commonly together, uh, but in our um, in our context, it's more along the lines of uh, the word list. A when looking at a single word uh, given in context, all the words uh, behind it before and uh, various combinations of the lengths in between. Uh, then, um, doing this, you can uh, do some part of speech tagging. And once you have those, those parts of speech, you can actually generate a parse tree using them. Uh, because if you don't have the, if you have the uh, parse of speech identified, then English becomes context-free language. Um, at this point, um, you can uh, we have uh, we plan on implementing a parser, which can turn it into a parse tree. If it can, if it can find a valid solution with a high confidence. Uh, then it means that your grammar, that uh, whatever you, your sentence is, is probably right. Um, we have some presentation. We have a demo of our OCaml skills. Uh, would you like to start it? Uh, this is what's going to render a first tree. Um, uh, in the future, uh, our intention for this is to render a parse tree uh, using OpenGL. Uh, right now, it's it's static, and that's not a parse tree. <laughs> as much as are you being an Are you being an No, th this is output. This is uh, intended to be a way for. Uh, I think it's just visualizing the output of the parser. Okay. Yeah, make sure that, uh, that it's come out with the right structure or whether or not the corpus needs to be revised. Um, are there any questions? Uh, yes. Can you at least go or sort of list what the overall what the intent of the project is? Like, what is it solving? Is it the intent is to uh, create a grammar, the grammar checker that does uh, the checks of sentences and a rather than like um, sort of machine learning, uh, very basic machine learning implementation, hopefully. Yeah. Right. Uh, so two things. Uh, one, are you planning on like releasing this as like an application or like as browser extensions um, and stuff like that? Oh, oh. Probably as a standalone application, I think. Okay. Uh, well, there's, there's that too, but um, uh, ideally we'd also have some sort of uh, client server thing so you can do them, so you can uh, write plugins for whatever text editor you like. Right, that would work for two things. Um, also, why are you using OpenGL? Uh, because unless it's like a 3D data structure that you have, you're probably better off using like uh, like Qt or um, just, just really anything else. else. What? Just drawing with X11. Uh, yeah, I'm aware of that, but I, I haven't seen it done this way. Okay. And, I mean, I haven't seen a OCaml used either. <laughs> uh, this is also about adventure as well as grammar checking. Okay, I mean, that's fine. It's just probably a little bit overkill for your usage. Oh, yes. Yeah. So, so, this like creates, uh, this looks at, you know, different uh, sentences and then it Creates grammars based on uh, a corpus uh, of an input that's believed to be mostly accurate. Okay. So could couldn't this also technically not only create a uh, natural correct grammar, but um, also create colloquial grammars as well for uh, uh, yes, yeah, so like lines and stuff. That'd be interesting. Yeah, just like on the floor. Yeah, you just need, you just need uh, enough input to give it a good idea of what uh, what the grammar should look like. Questions? What is the corpus you're using? What is the corpus you're using? We'll probably be using the uh, something derived from the pantry bank. Though currently it's, it's uh, taking in a uh, Lovecraft story 
as corpus because it seemed like a, like an interesting thing to give it. This is a largely untaxed corpus. Uh, it's trying to, this corpus uh, ideally should have almost no of semantic information along with the uh, sentences that, uh, for example, are using that as a, a test. In order to train the parser, we yeah, need yeah, some that's 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 what and through that to provide a bunch of sentences with associated hard traits. Great one. That's what currently what we have currently is not that. <laughs> well technically we currently don't have a uh, parser algorithm. Yeah. Okay. Um, is there any other questions or can we start or uh, stop arguing about okay. what we do have? Okay. Um, thank you.